All right, so I popped out and I just done a bit of sewing all the way around there. I was going to carry it along the bottom of the pocket and then I thought, no, there's really, no, I didn't want to do that. And I just done a few sewing stitches just down there, just so that they would, it would make my pockets for me. And that's what it looks like so far. I left the little bits of thread on and left those ones long up there but that looks pretty cool. I'm enjoying this and I'm liking it and my little birdie's stuck on there. So I just have to get my three sayings and I'm thinking I might ri um, rip them up. <laughs> I might write them on some card and just stick in there. So this one is going to go in that little pocket and my little booklet that I made. This one is going to hopefully fit in that little pocket and my tag that should be should be glued down. That one is going to hopefully fit in that little pocket. Yay! So I'm just going to finish this off a bit and I still haven't got some kind of image for the front. I'm not sure what I'm going to do there yet. But that's what it looks like so far. Pretty cool, hey? All out of a bit of upcycling of... Um, upcycling of voting papers. I'm just going to edge this a bit. I'm going to paint the back of that. Put that down so it doesn't get dirty. I'm just going to give that a paint with the black gesso. So I'll do that now. Okay, so that's the back of the card all done nicely. And there's the front. And I'm thinking maybe a little word. I've got some here somewhere. Um, I did have some somewhere. Hmm. I've moved them. Um, okay. Oh, here they are. I've moved them. They're over the other side. I've got some printed words and these are actually Gina Ahrens's Digi Downloads and I'm just trying to think what one I'd like to put out on here. Uh, I might use the word imagine. Uh, have I got uh, no, I might use create. Yeah. So I'm just going to cut that word out now. Put 
cut over there. Okay, so that's a bit straighter. And where do I want that? I think just above the heart, that'll do me. Okay, I'm sorry people, my, um, my thingo got full and I had, I finished it off completely so you didn't get to see right to the end of what I actually done but that's okay so I'll go through it now but I just wanted to show you um, what I started with these were our voting pamphlets a few weeks ago and I just folded the bottom up on one and folded it in three folded and then I fold it into three so I made a little booklet thing out of it and with some of the other papers I just ripped them to make the little um, to make the little journal and things inside of it. Ah, so here we are. Finished product. Do I need to come in a little bit? Okay, there we go. Um, I've just glued a couple of little buttons down here at the bottom. I don't know why. I just thought it had set it off. And I'm not going to worry about putting like a focal image on the front. I think it, it just looks good the way it is. So there's the front. And the back, I've just got my name when I made it and what it was for. It was for our Australian Art Group um, swap event. Australian Art Swap group event and it was for all to junk mail and I've put a little closure on with some of that twine and put a little just for a bit of weight I've got this little silver horseshoe to weight it down and I put a button that has like a little thing on the end I punched a hole in there and the button just sits through and I've just got that tied in under there. Okay, so this is it. I'll show you the back first. So that's all of the back, the back pages. And this is the front. And in the first little pocket, I have my altered card. I think they're a bit too long um, with the puzzle piece up the top for that little tab and that's the back so I've got that in there and the card was actually made from a piece of this as well a piece of the pamphlet and then the little booklet Oh, there's that bit. Of, I've been looking for that piece of wire <laughs> and it's right down here. Oh, I can't see for seeing some days. Okay. And the little booklet in the centre one, I've got one of my little birds I made on it. And the inside here, I have some of this. It's like a, a fabric washi tape or a fabric tape. So I've put a little bit down just behind there and I've put a little um, saying card. This one says, nobody can go back and start a new beginning, but anyone can start today and make a new ending by Maria Robins Robinson. And I put a little butterfly sticker on there and open that one up and I've got another one of those little cards and some of that tape on the back panel and this one says it is only in giving of oneself to others that we truly live and that's by Ethel Percy 
Andrus. And then in the center, I've got a little um, brad, and that's just holding in three other little inspirational positive thought cards. Uh, the bottom one says, it is a great thing to do a little thing well. And the next one says, don't count the days, make the days count. And this one says, give to the world the best you have and the best will come back to you. So that's my little flip book. And the book was actually made from some of that um, voting pamphlet. And the last little panel is the little art journal I made. And that's the front. And the back I just put this image that I had from doing my steampunk letter journals and just the, uh, a word. And the words in this book are from Gina Ahrens's Digi Downloads. I really like them. They're rather nice. And then inside I put one of my handmade flowers and the word inspire. And then on a couple of the other pages I've put some words as well. Like I have joy up there. I have blessed here. And I just stuck that piece of paper down. And this one's inspiration. And this one says cherish. And that one says friendship. And that one says smile and journal down here. And on the back page, I've also, this is a bit of calico that I um, stamped on. And the stamp is actually from Gina Ahrens's stamp set. So that was pretty cool. And I thought by putting some of the, like these words on, it's just a start for someone, whoever receives this in the swap, I don't know who it is yet, but I hope, you know, it gives them a little bit of inspiration to actually do some, some art in this little handmade art journal. Art journal. Okay, so that's that. So I hope you enjoyed this it, I just I'm really really happy with it very very happy with it and it's just from altering one of these how to vote pamphlets and that just wraps around there and I swing that around the button and it just hangs like that so that's what I done my altered junk mail I didn't actually get it in the mail but it's the same thing isn't it okay so thank you everyone for watching and you all have a great day and I'll catch you later bye bye